sexy. Super sexy. Tacos, babe. Tacos. Yum. We're finally making our way to the beach. Yeah. We got our tacos. to buy some uh, bait for fishing. Essentials. So we made it to the beach finally. We left at 9 and it's already 12. <laughs> <laughs> and we're finally getting here. <laughs> it's right there, sir. Oh, okay. Thank you. So $12. Hello. 10 bucks. 12. Oh, but you get two dollars. You get two back. Oh, okay. What did they ask you in front? Excuse me? What did they ask you? Oh, if, if the tide was down. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's, as long as they have the yellow flag on there, the tide's good. Oh, okay. Awesome. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Have a good one. Took a good four hours to get here. We did like 40 pit stops, but now we got the fishy poles going. Everybody's out there in the water. Um, here relaxing underneath the tent. <laughs>
Let's check it out. It's because they don't make 4x4 Ultimas, dude. I thought they did, maybe. <laughs> yeah. It's like when this Niagara 4x4 and the clearance is done. Right? It's all wheels are really good. No juice. Let's see. Nah, it's digging it's digging in. Yeah. Oh yeah. Plus the lift. Yeah, we're gonna put it on there. the goal of getting past that <laughs> you know the, the forerunner made me think that ah that's easy that's yeah cool. yeah you know, like yeah i forgot that this this was too soft the sands were too soft yeah we ended up here. going on this way but yeah, he, yeah we thought that it's too deep over there to avoid it you know we just thought okay let's go and get this side but you're good you're good to go yeah. head back don't get stuck <laughs> all right it's gonna rain so it might make it worse all right here comes the rain What was he thinking taking an Ultima into the sand? Walking into the hurricane. So now I have to pull out uh, Lorenzo's truck. Got stuck in the sand. Ready to go. I don't know what Kelly's doing, but they're there. <laughs> so we're having a nice uh, beach Sunday and the rain came in. 50% chance of rain means hurricane weather. So much action here at the beach. The beach patrol there in a on a lookout. Just searching for people or something. What's going on? No. The issue is, uh-huh. We got two call they got two calls of people uh -huh. left over in the sailboats. Oh really? So they're looking to see if anybody like came in or anything like that. There was a sailboat yeah, passing by a while ago. They didn't really see anything. Uh-huh. Oh, they got two ships out there right now. I saw them fly by that way. They were going that way, though. How long ago, though? When it barely started? Yeah. We are here at South Padre Island Convention Center. We are at the Hunting Fishing Expo 2016. You guys are missing out. Look at all the action. Hello. Hi. What are you guys doing? Giving away free stuff. We have some covers and some paintings. And where are we at? South Padre Island Convention Center. <laughs> place you need to be at, right here, <laughs> right now. What are we raffling off? We are raffling off the bottles for our first prize. Our second prize is our PSE couch. What do we got here? Hi, my name is Victoria Cappadona and I'm with Rio Grande Mesquite LLC. And um, we make products out of mesquite beans. Awesome. And we currently 
uh, make Castellano Ranch Mesquite Bean Jelly with Chili Pekin and without. And here is our jelly. And this weekend we're debuting our Rio Grande Mesquite Coffee, which is made out of mesquite beans, and our Rio Grande Mesquite Roasted Tea, which is made out of the seeds. Awesome, and where can they find it? They can find it at www.riograndemesquite.com. Thank you. Thank you. So right here we're selling some, some oils, different types of oils. Uh, yes, I'm uh, Ed Welliver with AMS Oil, and we're selling AMS Oil. It's uh, the first synthetic uh, lubricant that was developed back in 1972 that was API approved. We're here at Pescador Fishing Apparel with... Oh, and Okay, what, what are you doing here? What are you uh, selling? Yeah, we're, we're introducing this new line of fishing apparel here locally from the valley. Uh, we're just getting our name out, trying to do different expos, and uh, just here, you know, supplying our unique design to uh, to local fishermen. And it's all uh, dry fit, wicking material, hats, visors. Awesome, man. Cool. And we got the snake here. Still outdoors. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Where are you guys from? Houston, Texas. Houston, Texas. Houston, Texas. What, are you, what are you guys selling? What are you guys up to? We have over to? 135 guys, outfitters, and ranchers with us. Anytime you're looking to book hunting or fishing trips in the state of Texas, I personally talk to every Don't single one of these first guys. Go visit the, the ranches, go fishing with them, just like I did with these two guys. We have the best logo in Texas. They sell gear as well. So if you're ever looking for great fishing gear and great guides, eataloutdoors.com is the place to go. Awesome. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Thank you, guys. Thank you. No problem. <laughs> so here at the Hunting and Fishing Expo, and I ended up doing some interviews of all the uh, people out here, uh, helping Mike out. Best of the best right here, man. The best of the best? What shop is this? Hook, Line, and Seeker, Harlinger, Texas. Harlinger, Texas. How can they find you guys? Uh, on Facebook, uh, or Google us, or uh, give us a call at 956-970-1349. So for all your fishing fishing gear, come to Hookline and you'll get hooked up. Awesome. Boom. Welcome to Hookline the Sinker. <laughs> there you That's go. Cool. Yeah. Okay, we're here at the Hunters Expo. Uh, what are you guys selling here? Well, this is Fishing's Future. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's a not-for-profit organization. We focus on angling education for families. Mm -hmm. What we'll do is we'll take your family together, put them together outdoors, and we use fishing to bring that family together. One of the main things that we have found out if you take a seven-year-old girl and teach her how to fish, if mom and dad don't know how to fish, that kid doesn't go fishing. So what we do is we run a five to three hour uh, seminar, or we call them family fish camps. Get the family outdoors, we teach them knots, rods and reels, lures, how to put everything together. So you can come with zero knowledge to fishing the future and leave with the whole knowledge that you'll need to be able to go outside and actually catch a fish. Everything is free to the public, with a nonprofit organization, like I said and you'll leave with a bag of goodies, you'll have fishing lures, you won't get a rod and reel, but you will know how to put it together. And a lot of love and family fun time. It's a demonstration of what they actually do. Now once you, you, know, you, you learn the knots and the techniques and the rules and regulations, then you come out here and you learn how to cast. You teach them about the rod and the reel. Uh, then we have them cast, have them practice their accuracy, uh -huh. have them practice reel up. As we reel up, there's, you can see there's a bunch of colored fish out there and they're bringing their bait. If they bring it just right, if I can get that, that green, I missed a green one. Uh -huh. Maybe I can get this orange one right here. Bring it real slow. Bring it, bring it, bring it, bring it. Come on. And I can then, oh, I caught one. Under. There he is. There he is. Way to go. You're going to fish. That's they pretty bring, cool. I bring it up on the back side of the fish. Just finished shooting some video at the convention center. That's pretty cool. There was quite a few people. I was actually like a reporter here interviewing all these uh, vendors. Pretty cool. So Lorenzo gets stuck again. We're gonna pull him out of 